Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here then my name is Demi and I'm currently in recovery from an eating disorder. If you're not then welcome back. Just in case you're watching this and you didn't know, I was put into inpatient under a section four weeks ago almost. The journey has now come to an end. When I say come to an end, I don't mean the recovery, I mean the time in hospital because we still have a long way to go, but I am now ready to do it at home, fingers crossed. I think it's only just like really sinking in now that I'm going. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna get really emotional. It's just been the hardest four weeks and biggest eye opener ever. I'm just gonna start and pack up my stuff now. Not that there's that much stuff anyway, but yeah. Good morning everyone, today is the day, oh, gonna be free, I'm not gonna feel relaxed or settled until I'm on that motorway though I feel excited, I feel nervous, but I'm so ready for this. We are ready to go, 7.52, and I'm just like wandering around the room, wondering what to do with myself. Let's go. <laughs> Gonna go Costa straight away to get a coffee, cause your gal needs a coffee. <laughs> a coat hanger so that was a start but anyway i am back i am at home i can't quite put into words the way that i feel now obviously i'm glad to be home but i'm also very i'm very nervous i'm excited but i'm also scared also really struggling with how i have changed in the last four weeks and coming home to look in the mirror wasn't easy for me to sit here and say that this is all easy and that it's not that bad i would be lying because it is extremely difficult however i'm back at home and we're gonna keep on smashing this we're gonna keep on going up and gonna challenge foods gonna have different foods gonna keep to kind of a meal plan kind of not maybe add more some days maybe not as much some days because at the end of the day sometimes we are more hungry and other days we're not and that's normal <laughs> yesterday i was a lot hungrier than what i was today today my hunger signals have been a bit confusing but that doesn't mean that i've not eaten i've carried on eating even when i'm not hungry and that is what you should be doing too tonight i'm gonna have some pasta that I've been craving for a very long time. I'm gonna show it you in a minute. Sorry, I just, I've just realized. I don't know why I'm talking with this in my hand still, but anyway, I'm gonna go and get my pasta prepared. Not that I'm gonna be cooking much because it just needs boiling in the pan and then the sauce adding. She a chef. This is the pasta of choice. I don't know if you can see, wait there. It's like a mushroom, porcini mushroom and truffle like parcel things today's dinner we are challenging a wrap i haven't had one of these for so long you know what there is nothing to be scared of we're on a journey of gaining weight here so let's make a wrap <laughs> I'm going out for dinner. Well, I say dinner, but you might say lunch. So I'm going out for dinner lunch. It's gonna be like a little challenge for me because usually I wouldn't let myself do things like this or I would be like, well, if I'm going out for dinner, then that means I can only have something small in the evening. 
So yeah, I'm gonna go and challenge eating out. I'm gonna bring you with me. I'm gonna take the camera, I'm gonna order what Demi really wants, not the healthiest option. I'm literally hungry now though, so I just made myself some blueberries and I didn't make them. Make, I just got some blueberries and grapes out of the fridge to snack on before I go because I was feeling hungry, so <laughs> getting snacks. I know it's only fruit, but it's something, it's nutrients. I'm going to finish my fruit and then I'm going to go and have dinner out with my dad. So let's go. finally got my hair done. I've been dreaming of this day now for the longest time. We got it done and I've just got myself ready and dressed for like the first time in ages. I feel emotional. I'm gonna go and eat my tea out and I'm really looking forward to it for the first time in ages. And we're gonna order what Demi wants off the menu and enjoy myself. I'm just wearing this little dress. Let's go and enjoy and eat. I am actually really hungry, so. Can I just say it's seven o'clock and she's out? <laughs> this is very rogue. I didn't record that much from when I went out last night because <laughs> What I wanted to order was a pan fried sea bass, but they'd actually sold out, so I couldn't have the pan fried sea bass. In that split moment, I had to decide something else. As you know, when you go out, it's a big deal anyway, and when you plan what you want and they don't have what you want, it was a bit of a shock. I dealt with it, I had some chicken instead. I still did it, smashed it got through it. I've literally eaten out twice this week now, once for my dinner and once for my tea, so I'm literally so happy with myself and I just want to keep on doing this until it becomes normal again. I just want to say that it's okay to go and eat out and I just want to also say that it's not been easy at all. I'm literally left with this guilt and feeling like I am massive in my brain and it's very overwhelming and exhausting but I just keep reminding myself that it's about being healthy again and being strong and being able to get back into doing what I enjoy and working and running and not that running matters because it really doesn't but it does because it really does help me mentally and everybody knows how much I do actually have a passion for exercise. I am so eager to get back into that, but I know that right now is not the time. I just wanna to say to anybody, keep pushing through the guilt and don't let it get to you. I know it's way easier said than done. You can do it, so let's keep smashing it. Tonight, I am actually having spaghetti bolognese with my family, which is one that my mum cooks, which is unreal which I convinced myself that I no longer liked which was a big fat lie from the brain of Demi Proudman because she does like it she loves it so tonight we're joining in with the family and we are getting involved and we are having spag ball <laughs> here if you watched all the way to the end then thank you so much for watching honestly i hope that it's given you a little bit of motivation to carry on recovering or just really get stuck into it honestly from my experience so far it is 100 million percent worth it i know i'm not recovered yet i still have a long way to go and a lot of habits and things to overcome but it's not going to happen overnight and it's a very long process but i can say so far from the way I'm feeling and just everything in general has gone like from this to this. 
no, let's say this to this. It's not this yet, but it will be. And it will be for you too, if you keep pushing and just keep going. I hope you enjoyed watching. I'm gonna be uploading a lot more now. If you wanna see anything in particular or have any questions, then let me know in the comments. I'll see you in the next video. Sending lots of love, bye.